Good morning, Hank. It's Tuesday. It's Question Tuesday, the day that I answer real questions from real nerd fighters. Let's get right to it. What are you reading? Well, I just read an amazing book by a first novelist named Hank Green. I don't want to say anything more until it's available for pre-order, but wow, it's like properly brilliant. And now I'm reading An Introduction to Global Health Delivery, which is quite different from Hank's book, but also excellent. What's your favorite song at the moment? So my kids have discovered that their Uncle Hank is a musician whose songs you can listen to on Spotify, and they won't stop listening to him. I've probably heard This Is in Hogwarts 10 thousand times in the last two weeks, and I have to say, it's pretty darn good. Is this becoming a Hank Green appreciation vlog? No more Hank for the rest of the video. Thoughts on Brexit and pears? Now that is a Question Tuesday question, so sometimes I'll be at the grocery store and I'll think, you know what future me would like to eat? Pears. A ton of pears. And so I'll buy a bunch of pears. And then later, when I am future me, I'll open up the refrigerator and think, Ugh, oh, I really wish I hadn't gotten these pears. I wish I could just return them and get my money back because I completely misapprehended my appetite for pears. But you can't return pears. Speaking of which, pears or apples? Mm, I don't know if we're still talking about Brexit, but regardless, Apples. In Turtles All the Way Down, how can Daisy say that Attack of the Clones is the most underrated Star Wars movie? That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. I'm gonna try not to respond to hostility with hostility here, but look, Daisy's wrong about a lot of things, but she is right about this. Empire Strikes Back, correctly rated as the best Star Wars movie. A New Hope, also correctly rated as excellent. Return of the Jedi is, if anything, slightly overrated. Rogue One and The Force Awakens are both rated correctly. The Phantom Menace is correctly rated as the worst. Revenge of the Sith, widely and appropriately believed to be the best of the prequels, leaving Attack of the Clones as the only and ergo most underrated Star Wars movie. Hey John, you working on anything new? Yeah, I've got a new series over at Hank Games called John Green Solves Your Problems, in which I play FIFA while solving people's problems. So far, I've solved the problem of somebody who couldn't reach the spot on their back that itched and